For two and a half years, the Bemidji Police and Sheriff's Office have used Project Lifesaver as a tool to track down someone with cognitive disorders if they're missing. Haiti Clatter shows us how one local organization is pitching in to the cause with an order of pancakes. It's called Project Lifesaver because it does just that. The Bemidji Police and Sheriff's Office use this device to help locate missing people with cognitive disorders such as dementia and autism. It'll start out as a very faint beep and then as you get closer to it, it'll get louder and louder and then that's how we locate them. For Stacy Barr, Project Lifesaver has given her a peace of mind when it comes to her autistic son, David. He was the first person in Beltrami County to have the device. Knowing that the, pro that the project and the program was finally something we could employ in our lives, it was such a huge relief. Project Lifesaver is not a GPS device. Instead, it's a dedicated radio frequency signal used to help locate the client. The Bemidji JCs are continuing their mission to help others with the pancake breakfast to benefit Project Lifesaver. This project benefits community because when somebody is wearing this bracelet, if they get lost or wander off, they can actually be located hopefully within minutes to hours versus days or even longer. The pancake breakfast will take place at the bunkhouse. I thought it would be something beneficial to partner with the JCs to um, help give back to the community. There are currently 22 clients in Beltrami County and in the city of Bemidji using Project Lifesaver. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. The All You Can Eat Breakfast is Saturday from 8 to 11 in the morning. You can find more information on Project Lifesaver at our website at lptv.org. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.